there. I want to die for her. So, yeah. I'm going to assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. Gotta hurry. Shit! Oh, shit! Okay, then. 
Clementine, can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing. Oh, wait. The window is through. Go. God. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Look at him staring. Look at him staring at him. I'm going to eat his butt. <laughs> He did a big part of in my phone his things, so I'm gonna come up and it. That is the idea. Find your friends. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Adios, have a good time. Hey kid, close call back there. 
Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kitty. You got it. I'm okay. You know, considering. I do. Yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I thought you needed the help. Ah, that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carmen. Cool it for a minute. Okay, sorry. Hey, let's believe you're sorry. I'm sorry, there's a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. I was there though. What I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. He didn't do that. It's just a walkie-talkie. It probably wasn't much use to begin with. It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man, Clementine, another thing. Oh, my God. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? No. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. You watch your butt. Hey, Lee. Do you have a second? Do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. Me too. This motor in's pretty this damn defendable. Pretty damn we block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most